What's up, guys? This is Joe, and welcome to episode 17 of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII, and we're back in the Nibelheim Mako reactor. Man, where did I go? Right on that plank right there. No, oh, dang, I was, like, stuck back there. <laughs> where? Right on this. Look, I can't... Every, nope, a little more forward. Hey, look, I'm there pushing you go. down, and I'm going up, yep, all right? Classic, what the heck, man? Classic controls, the same reason why kids don't like Resident Evil 1. Yeah, Resident Evil 1, I'm <laughs> sorry. Resident Evil 1, on a scale of 0 to 10, I'd give it a... Three. Oh, no, I liked it. I liked the game, but the controls were unnecessarily annoying. Yeah, they are pretty tough, but I'm so used to that series, like, second now, nature. Now, 4 is one of my favorite games of all time. 4 is really good, yeah. All oh, right. dang, look at that name. This is Genova, right? The lock won't open. <laughs> Choking on Tootsie Rolls tootsie or roll. Laffy Taffies oh, or whatever over there. I had a Tootsie Roll, and I was trying to hide it, and I tried to swallow it so I could give, do Sephiroth's part. And all right, Choked so. on it. This is the reason for the malfunction. This part part is broke. This part is broken. <laughs> Broaching. Cloud, close the valve. All right, it looks like a part in here. It's kind of gross. Look. Yeah, I guess it does. Well, I guess we close. Where is that at? The <laughs> valve. Move down. I see. Like, I mean, if I was playing by right myself, right in front of it. There you go. He couldn't do that himself. Nope. Forget that. You're you're My a subordinate. God. You're doing it for I him. I mean, he's. Yeah. Fine. Sephiroth thing. What did he say? He said, why did it break? Oh, dang. Oh, he's, he's looking in. He's short. Yep. The great Sephiroth's short. <laughs> now I see. Hojo. We've heard about him before. Yep. But even doing this will never put you on the same level as Professor Gast. It's a new name. This is the, this is a system that condenses and freezes the Mako energy. That is, when it's working correctly. Now, what does Mako energy become when it's further condensed? Hmm. Oh, um, oh yeah, it becomes materia. For all of you that wanted to know what materia is, there you go. Yep. Condensed Mako, right? Yep. Right, normally. But Hojo put something else in there. Take a look. Oh, Alright, let's take a look. Hopefully it's not as scary as that Genova pod. Yeah, I know. It might be, though. Dang. Are you... God. <laughs> look through the window. Damn. There we go. Oh, dang. We're gonna take a peek into one of these pods. What's in here? Please don't be scary. I'm not in the mood. Oh, uh, my God. Dang, it's got a deformed Why? troll. Why has it gotta be <laughs> like that? Gross. It used to be a person. But what is this? Normal members of Soldier are humans that have been showered with Mako. You're different from the others, but still human. Well, I was worried about that. Yeah, I know. But what, what are they? They've been exposed to a high degree of Mako, far more than you. So that's it's what happens. Gross. Why are they doing this to people? Is this some kind of monster? Exactly. And it's Hojo of Shinra that produces these monsters. Mutated living organisms produced by Mako energy. That's what these monsters really are. Look at that apostrophe S. <laughs> ah, man, I love it. Dang. I love it. I love it. Typos. Nor members of Soldier, you mean you're different? Of course, Cloud. You should know oh, this dang, by now. Wait, what's going on? Hey, Sephiroth. N no. He's having like a brain hammer. Was I? Oh, oh that sword out of nowhere. Moves. I'm surprised he didn't cut us in half. Was I created this way too? He looks human to me. He looks Whoa. fine. Looks like he's got pants on. Sephiroth. Am I the same as all these monsters? You see that? He's got pants. Well, look. I feel. I don't know. It's like a trench coat. <laughs> you saw it. All of them are humans. Human? No way. Uh oh. I've always felt since I was small that I was different from the others, special in some way, but not like this. Hey, he thought he was an IB. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what the? Oh. Oh, it looks like screaming. Please they, stay in there. It looks like beans. <laughs> are we gonna have to fight this kid? No, he's just dang. His legs are on fire. Oh, it's like a tanning. That would have been a cool fight. Yeah, that's awesome. what happens. Like that's what we're gonna look like when we finish the IB program. Ah, uh, yeah, we're gonna. That's literally us right there. Fifty-four pods. Yep. Graduation. will uh. Yeah, we'll open the pods for yeah, us. Yeah, dang. My human. No, so that Sephiroth, was. It could be Sephiroth. You can do it then. No, that's Cloud. Oh, I didn't quite understand what Sephiroth was saying at the time. I was even more surprised by the fact that Shinra was producing monsters. I mean, we went to the Shinra headquarters and saw, like, is Red 13 a product of this, you think? No, he's not. Damn, Shinra, the more I hear, the more I hate him. Who would have ever thought the Mega Reactor held a secret like that? Oh, <laughs> that would seem to explain the increase in the number of monsters recently. I think we should listen carefully to Cloud, don't you think, Barrett? Barrett, come on. Why are you talking to me? Save the game, take uh, keep talking, right? Get it over with. Fine. Yeah. Hmm, poking his damn nose in where it don't belong. Cloud, why don't you finish that story? Phew. <laughs> it's the best. Tifa, you were waiting outside then? That's right, she was outside, yes. We returned to Nibelheim. Sifroth confined himself at the inn. He didn't even try to talk to me. Then all of a sudden, he just disappeared, right? We found him inside the biggest building in Nibelheim. 
The villagers used to call it the Shinra Mansion. Long ago, people from Shinra used to live in that mansion. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, it's <laughs> like, the Shinra Mansion, yeah. <laughs> it's funny because even back then when you go in, it's like a derelict. Empty, yeah. Uh, it's whatever. Yeah. All right, so... I wonder how old the Shinra are. Like, how long have they been around? Yeah, that's a good question. I don't know how long. Dang. You know, I mean, this part coming up, it's not really all that important. We, I mean, it's important, but we don't have to, like, read all the dialogue. Yeah, they look like that guy with a cape, by the way. Yeah, but anyway, this <laughs> episode is reminding me how long has... Uh, when you said how long has it been here, it reminded me. Today... <laughs> I have not been on a field trip since like oh, eighth dang. grade. Oh dang, he's lucky. And today, for chemistry of all classes, where should I go first? By the way, up to the right. Um, up to the right. Yep, all the way up. Oh, dang. there you go. God. To the right. There. there you go. Anyway, I went on a field trip in high school, and I don't think that's really a big thing that happens. Why field often. trips in high school? And yeah. where am I? What am I even doing there? Right I know, there. I know. All right, there you go. All right, so no sign of Sephiroth. That's bull because he's right in here. There you there go. There we go. Now I remember this. We got to go down, right? Yep. Spiral staircase, and then you'll see the nutcase himself. This kind of looks like the uh, spiral staircase we had to go down a minute ago or up. Remember? I think. Yeah, in the one of the houses in Com. Yeah, I thought for a second it was gonna link up. Hey, let's go get um. Oh. Yeah, too bad. <laughs> right? There's a door right there. Yeah, that would be Vincent, right? Yep. He's in. Oh, there's his door. Oh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. We can't come go on. in there though. Nope, can't do <laughs> oh, it now. On. But I don't remember. Do you just have to come back here and go there? Or is it. there something you have to have to go in there? I don't know. No, you just come here. An organism that was apparently dead was found in a 2,000-year-old geological stratum. Ugh. Professor Gass named that organism Genova. So Genova's an alien? Apparently, it's been held 2,000 years. X year, X month, X day. Genova confirmed to be an ancient. X year, X month, X day. Genova project approved. The use of Mako Reactor 1 approved for use. Does oh that mean God. Eris is an alien too? Apparently, if Genova's an ancient, you saw what Genova looks like. Hopefully, is Eris doesn't turn into oh that. Ugh, that's disgusting. I always like this library scene because I, I feel like this particular scene gives so much weight to the like plot line yeah. and all that kind of stuff. How many books has he read already? He's got piles. My mother's name is Genova. Genova Project. Is this just a coincidence? Probably not. <laughs> yeah, I mean, how I many don't... other people you know named Genova? Exactly. Professor Gas, why didn't you tell me anything? Why did you die? Gas is dead. So apparently. Gas, maybe that's his. No. Uh, no. I was I... gonna say. Nah, never mind. <laughs> All right, fine. <laughs> Let's see what he can we talk to him? Talk him out. I don't of know. This? Remember last time we tried to talk to him, he swung a sword at me. Let me be alone. All right. All right. We, we can't. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we can't mess with him now. So All right. So we just gotta leave. Head up top. All right. Now, oh man, every time I think about something to say, I forget. Oh really dang, cool. Sephiroth didn't come out of the Prisoner Mansion. Oh, I can't skip this. <laughs> dang, the piles of books. This reading, reminds me of that reading. Twilight Zone episode. Have you seen that one? Which Did one? you ever watch Twilight Zone? Or? I've seen only a few. Where There's one where there's a guy, he finally, don't worry about this, yeah. but uh, he finally gets to be alone. Like, something happens. I think it's a nuclear, like, attack, but he survives. What, is he, like, in a library and he has nothing to do with reading? No, he, uh... <laughs> He's been waiting, like, his life is so hectic, he never has time to read or anything. And so finally everyone's gone, except for him. And so he piles up all his books, he's finally happy, he can just sit there and read. Breaks his glasses. That's <laughs> pretty terrible. Wow, I should watch Twilight Zone. Twilight it's a, Zone is awesome. It's a pretty famous, are you talking about the old, old Twilight Zone? Oh yeah, Zone? don't watch that new crap. Yeah. I mean, I know I sound ridiculous saying, oh, watch the old stuff, it's better. But honestly, this is one, like... Objectively, Just put Y on here. The uh, the original Twilight Zone is easily better than the '80s version. Like no yeah. question. I've always wanted to brush up on those. I've heard they're very, very good. Nick. All right, so I guess we can't leave. So I guess there's something else we have to oh, do. Oh, we got to go, go inside, back down, down to the basement. Yep. Oh uh, my god. Yep. And all right, it's upstairs, downstairs. I can't believe Cloud slept in here. I would have went back to the hotel. Yeah, like I, I don't sleep think I was in sleeping this, this dingy old place. Dang. It might be haunted, just like my room. Haunted. Yeah, it's got. He still has ghosts by his window. Yep. For those of you who didn't watch that episode, my room makes creaky, wispy ghost noises. <laughs> yep, it's out of nowhere too, particularly when we're editing. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's ridiculous. All right. Um. Also, I want to know if you guys want me to start the Banjo Kazooie Let's Play now or wait till I'm done because apparently there's a. I was planning on starting it like a couple days ago, but somebody said wait. So oh, we got. I want to hear your guys' opinion on that. But uh, Sephiroth is laughing at yeah, us. Yeah, he's not at all this pretty point. creepy. Dang. Sephiroth like lost it. Apparently. Yeah, he completely has lost it now. Who is it? Mm, traitor. Traitor. I didn't do anything to him. I know. You ignorant traitor. I'll tell you. The this planet was originally belonged to the Cetra. Cetra was an 
it, itinerant? Yeah, itinerant. I, what is that? Itinerant. I don't Right, know. so they would migrate in, settle the planet, then move on. I guess that's what that means. Yep, there you go. <laughs> At the end of their harsh, hard journey, they would find the promised land of supreme happiness. But those that disliked the journey appeared. Those who stopped their migrations built shelters and elected to lead an easier life. Humans? Yeah, probably. They yeah. took what they they took that which the Cetra and the planet had made without giving back one wit in return. What's a wit? I, I was just gonna say that. <laughs> Those are your ancestors. How does he know Sephiroth? Long ago, disaster struck this planet. Your ancestors escaped. They survived because they hid. The planet was saved by sacrificing the Cetra. After that, your ancestors in- continued to increase. Now all that's left of the Cetra is in these reports. I wonder who compiled these reports. I don't know. What does that have to do with you? Don't you get it? An ancient name, Genova, was found in the geolog- geological stratum of 2,000 years ago. The Genova Project. The Genova Project wanted to produce people with the powers of the ancients. No, the Cetra. I am the one that was produced. Uh-oh. P- produced? He's not a real human? Apparently he's not. He's been produced by the Genova Project. Yes. Professor Gass, leader of the Genova Project and genius scientist, produced me. H- how did he... Oh, God. He's taking big steps. Except yeah. Sephiroth? Dang, he is taking yeah, big steps. Yeah, he is taking big steps. Out of my way. I'm going to see my mother. Beast Genova? music. Genova? Yep. Now we have to make our way back to the Maker Reactor. But we're going to be in for a surprise when we leave. Oh. You'll see how quick Sephiroth can work. I think I know exactly what you mean. I yes. can't wait to get there. <laughs> it's it's amazing how quick this man can work. Well, he does have materia, so... Yeah, Genova's one of those characters like I really like, even though there's not a whole lot of backstory, like... I mean, there's a little bit, but... It's just... It is pretty interesting. That's what makes it interesting, the lack of... It's like a a mystery, I guess. Yeah. (laughs) I mean, I never would have expected playing this game that... Especially after playing Kingdom Hearts first, that Sephiroth is not human. Nope. Aliens and everything. Aliens. Well, anyways, look at this! Everything is on fire! We're gonna be treated to an epic, epic cutscene coming up after this. I don't know who Zang is. Uh, Oh, I know who he is. He's uh, Tifa's teacher. Teaches their martial Uh, arts. Yep. I guess it makes sense. But, uh, obviously Sephiroth did this, and we're gonna see... Awesome, like, little cutscene here in a second. So awesome, it's inside of the CD inserts in the case. Yeah, oh, that's another thing I wanted to mention in the last episode, but I'll talk about it in a second. Oh, uh, where do we go? It's, oh, dang. <laughs> Are you oh, gonna die? I guess. <laughs> it's going here. It's a oh, casual conversation. Not. Pretty sure Cloud's mom gets killed in one of these houses. Oh, Sephiroth killed his mother. I think that's the house right there he just went in. Well, I can't do anything, so. Uh, oh, you're not moving? No, oh, I'm dang. not doing that. Terrible. Sephiroth, this is too terrible. All right, are they gonna show kind of us? Sad, honestly. Hopefully, oh, show it, please. Oh, apparently not yet. That guy's just chilling out of it. Was burning out. <laughs> he's chilling out. I'm sure he's. Oh, not. they're cutting oh. people in the head. Oh, there. there you go. This Legendary. Is, this is awesome. Legendary. This was another uh, scene in the trailer, of course. Yep. I know. I keep saying uh, there's no point in plugging the trailer now that the Let's Play is 16, 17 episodes in. But if you never saw the trailer, I highly recommend you watch it because it was awesome. Yep. Bike scene. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, he's popping out of the window. Yep. If, never mind. Just see the trailer. You know what we're talking about. All right, we're getting a nice pan out view of what Mount Nibelir. Yep. And the reactor. And the texture looks stretched on the rock, but whatever. I'm yeah, it's nitpick. old. Right? <laughs> Anyways, here we are. We need, I'm happy they saved us the trip here. Yeah, seriously. Why do we need to come back here? I don't. Oh, because he's gonna see his mother. We want to stop him before he does Why? anything else because he's crazy as hell. All right, cloud. Move. Get over right over there. I did, every time I try to walk over there, it would push me down farther. Uh, like I would push buttons. down and it would go up. Like that's ridiculous. But I've read somewhere that the. The whole game is on all three discs, but the only difference is, like, the cutscenes or something. Yep. Oh, so Papa. that's pretty cool. If that's true. I don't know. Sephiroth, I'll do Tifa. Fine. Sephiroth did this to you, didn't he? Sephiroth, soldier, make a reactor, Shinra, everything! I'm just gonna say... I hate them all! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And watch, this is bull right here. There, I thought only he, Sephiroth could use that sword. What the hell? What, did she just pick just up Just picked sword? it up. Awesome. Papa's dead on the floor. Dang, that's yep, ridiculous. he got beans, so did Cloud's mom. Watch Sephiroth someone get his sword back in a second. I don't yeah, know. Mother, I'm here to see you. Please open this door. <laughs> oh, I thought it was oh, open. Dang. Damn it. Oh, she yep. does have a sword. How could you do that to Papa and all the townspeople? I can't believe she had the sword. That doesn't even look as long. Oh, oh he doesn't even give. All I gotta say is... she gonna is... fall down the stairs? <gasps> Damn! Oh. Full dramatic whole flight of stairs. She would have broke her back. Dang, she yep. just fallen on the stairs. She Those are metal steps, down the stairs. people. 
My God. She would have died. Tifa should not be walking. I these know. Days. She should I mean, be in a wheelchair thing. All right, so now should we go after Sephiroth or help Tifa? Not that uh, we have a choice. I think we have to help Tifa. Yeah, yeah we don't right. have a choice. Pick her up. We could have stopped this all from happening. I know. You promised. You promised that you'd come when I was in trouble. Oh, remember that promise? Wait a minute. Oh, dang. Apparently he kept it. I thought he didn't know about I it. Thought, though. First of all, I thought he didn't know about it. Then I thought he never kept it. But apparently this is going on way a long time ago. Yeah, I know. Apparently. Dang. <laughs> I don't know if you guys hear that. My phone being classic. All right. So now that she's moved, now I guess we can go. Up now here. we can go into the chamber and see what's going on in here. Though. I hope Genova's not in here because I'm still scarred for life. She's in here full form. All right, head in all. Was that her? Nope. <laughs> That's something. I, yeah. I never got what that was, actually. No, I don't know. It's kind of weird. Dude. I know there's one part where Sephiroth, like, pulls off. The... Coming up. Yeah, I think that now, isn't it? Yeah, it's coming up. That's that, like, huge umbilical cord. Yeah. Ugh. Mother, let's take this planet back together. I thought of a great idea. Let's go to the promised land. Sephiroth. My family, my hometown. How could you do this to them? You don't give, look. Do you think Sephiroth cares? He's he didn't not even, even turn human. around. <laughs> They've come again, Mother. With her superior ma power, knowledge, and magic, Mother was destined to become the ruler of this planet. A little full of himself, huh? Yeah, I would say so. Oh, dang. Dang. Yep, Sephiroth talking thing. Those worthless creatures. This is an awesome. This looks different from the other cutscenes. Yeah, it does. Are stealing the planet from Mother. Oh, oh but now I'm here with you. So don't worry. This is creepy. It's really creepy. <laughs> now this is awesome right here. Yep. Oh. Fully rips the chassis. I don't know what blood. that is. Blood coming out of it. I don't even know if that was blood. You see that little shake he did with like that yeah, he body? full out metal thing. Yeah, yes. like, I don't know, but that, I sync that up perfectly to the music in the trailer. Plug. Oh, plug it. No, <laughs> and there's the real Genova in her Ooh. prime with eyeballs galore and one glowing. Dang, thing. what does that say under Genova? Up there? It looks like Sony Corporation. I'm pretty sure that's what it says. Really. What about my sadness, my family, friends, the sadness of having my hometown taken away from me? It's the same as your sadness. So does little. Yeah, compared my to God. Sephiroth's name. Yeah. Oh, I think he thinks he's beast. <laughs> my sadness? What do I have to be sad about? I'm the chosen one. I have been chosen to be the leader of this planet. Dang. By who? I know, right? I have orders to take this planet back from you, from you stupid people for the Setcher. What am I supposed to be sad about? All right. Oh, can we get him now, please? Sephiroth, I trusted you. Oh, then they're about to go have a confrontation. Now you're not the Sephiroth I used to know. Now you're just somebody that I used to know. Remember that song I should? Yeah. Oh, oh awesome. dang, they gotta go for it. Come on. They jump at each other in like class swords and. Oh, awesome. no. No, apparently they. Don't tell me they're gonna cut back to the main, like. Cliffhanger! <sighs> oh, my! And that's the end of my story. Wait a damn minute. Ain't there more? That's what we're saying. I don't remember. What are you, how can you not... I know. What happened to Sephiroth? In terms of skill, I couldn't have killed him. Official records state Sephiroth is dead. I read it in the newspaper. You think Sephiroth is... Shinra ain't going to the paper, so you can't really rely on that information. Yeah. <laughs> I want to know the truth. I want to know what happened then. I challenged Sephiroth and lived. Why didn't he kill me? I'm alive, too. Seems like a lot of this doesn't make sense. What about Genova? It was in the Shinra building, right? Shinra shipped it from Nibelheim to Midgar. Did someone else carry it out after that? It was missing from the Shinra building. Sephiroth? Or maybe she got up and left. Yeah. And thought ahead. Damn, don't none of this make sense. I'm going, 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 gone. What the f And I'm leaving the thinking to you. <laughs> awesome, awesome, Barrett. He's he doesn't get enough credit. He's awesome. Barrett's awesome. Yo, Cloud, let's get a move on. Alright. All right. Well, we're good. Now we have officially, you know, kind yes. of had watched the uh, the cutscene here at Calm. Yeah, we've laid the groundwork now for the rest of the story. Basically, this is a big, big thing. So now, yeah, this look at this. How bad was I when Sephiroth cut me? She Let's shouldn't be alive. She, I thought, yep. Yeah, <laughs> like, I thought I mean, you were there's not like Oh, again with dots. Maybe things don't didn't happen like Sephiroth. Who knows? I don't know like, how Cloud you could not remember a fight with Sephiroth. Uh, I'm pretty sure Cloud would have been dead. Cloud should have died. Tifa should have died. Sephiroth should still be alive. And, ready for this? How did the town build up so quick after being burned? Oh, yeah, dang. What the f- Oh, what is she gonna give us? A P-A-O. PMS? No, what the f- just <laughs> My god, PHS, dang. That's oh, what you used to- Oh, dang. That's what you used to, what, switch characters out on the map? Yep, you can use it on the map to change your party members and all that. Alright. 
All right, so <laughs> we've done everything here now, so we're good. Yeah, pretty. M- oh wait, should we go to the Chocobo Farm real quick, or Chocobo should we do that Farm? Next we'll do that next episode. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and end the episode. I guess I'll go ahead and just yep. end it on the world. Perfect map, the- two 20 minute episodes. Great. Yep, so on the next episode, now that we're done with cutscenes, we'll finally be able to continue with the game here. Yes, we're going to be moving on to the Chocobo Farm, fighting a mini-boss, and then Mithril Mines. Yep, Chocobo... F- mini... Yeah, okay, yeah. Now I, I know what you're talking now about. Now you get it. Alright, so after that, yeah, we're going to go to the mines, and hopefully we do go to Mount Nibel after that, right? Later, later, later. Or, no, what's ap- what's after the uh, the mine? Juno. Juno, yeah, okay, okay. Now, anyway, I want to <laughs> thank you guys for watching this episode of Final Fantasy VII, and I will see you guys back for the next one. See you guys. <laughs>